Hi everyone, so today I wanted to do a video for you guys, but I also wanted to show you my little guy so you guys can see his progress and how big he's getting. He's pretty huge. You want to say hi? Huh? Want to say hi? Yeah? Yeah, so he's about four and a half months and um, he weighs about 14 pounds now, so he's getting pretty big. Say hi YouTube. So yeah, we have to keep these little mittens on him because he um, has eczema and he scratches his face. So we keep these little mittens so that he doesn't make his face worse and lets it heal a little bit. <gasps> Hi. Hi, cutie. <sighs> and then he's wearing his new shirt that I showed you guys in the um, my haul video from the Children's Place. It says Captain of My Crib. Isn't that cute? <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to go give him back to his dad because it's time for him to eat and I will be right back. So today I wanted to talk to you guys about my new skincare. Um, a couple weeks back, if you follow me on Twitter, um, you know that I ordered some new skincare and um, I ordered from the Michael Todd True Organic Skincare. I um, kind of wanted something different. I, got, I guess I was getting kind of tired and bored with my same old routine of just acetophil cleanser and um, moisturizer and I noticed that I was getting, um, I still have a few um, like little red bumps here and a couple little bumps on my forehead that I didn't have before and I just think it's my body's hormones are starting to go back to normal so um, I think that's what it has to do with it. Um, Maybe it just could be, you know, the weather change or something like that. Also, I'm moving too, so there's a little bit of stress going on there, and that could also be um, what's wrong as well. But I decided to try the um, Michael Todd True Organics because I've been seeing so many reviews from fellow YouTube um, beauty gurus, and I've heard nothing but positive things about it. Um, I've heard hundreds of people say that this was like the best skincare. Um, uh, it's can be a little bit pricey depending on what you order, um, what type of skincare, like for the um, anti-aging stuff, it's kind of expensive. Um, but it's not that bad actually, I think it's you know pretty affordable for the size of what you get. Um, so I was on the website several weeks back and um, I wanted to try the skincare and I didn't want to order all full size products because I wasn't sure how my skin was going to react to um, organic um, skincare and one of the things I like about this is that um, it tells you everything as far as ingredients um, that are in each of the products. And you get this little pamphlet in one in the uh, discovery kits. Um, so basically um, mine is for acne oily skin, um, which I like that because sometimes products that are made just for acne uh, tend to dry my skin out. Even though my skin is really oily, I feel like those products really strip my skin and I feel like I have to double up on the moisturizer and if I don't, I feel like my skin overproduces a lot of oil just because it's so dry and everything just feels so tight and I hate that feeling and um, I don't quite have that feeling with the Michael Todd and I have noticed that right here under my um, the beginning parts of my eyebrow I do have started getting some dry patches I don't know if it's because I switched my skincare uh, just because I've been on the City of Phil uh, skincare for way over a year and you know my skin's used to it that's just probably the, just a change of um, skincare so I actually ordered, I have a bunch of these little bottles, but I ordered um, two of the self-discovery kits and the day that I ordered them, they just happened to be the special value of the day and I think they were $19 and I found a coupon code online for 20% off and um, so they came out to like 15 bucks each so I decided to order two of those kits. Now those kits, they come with um, really small pieces. Now I saved my empty bottles so I can show you, um, but they're all one ounce um, bottles and I thought that by now I would know if this is going to work for me. Um, and I'm actually on my second, um, set of, uh, five trio, or the, not the five trio, this doesn't make any sense, five trio, five piece, um, one ounce set, and, um, so I wanted to show you guys each of the pieces because I just got my order in the mail today of my full size pieces that I ordered, so I wanted to show you what you get, um, and it tells you in detail, like I said, all of the, um, ingredients in the self-discovery kits, which if that's, if you want to try this, I would probably go that way instead of spending the money. Um, it may cost you a little bit more, obviously for full sizes, um, but you get a lot more products. So if you don't like it, you're pretty much wasting a lot of your money because you get, um, a lot more products. So 
Um, the self-discovery kit comes with the uh, charcoal detox uh, cleanser, which is a gentle deep pore cleanser. And um, what I like about this one is that it says certified vegan. And the whole purpose about this line is that um, I guess the the founder of this line, um, it's on their website if you want to go read it. I'll put the link to it below. Um, found a lot of the uh, skincares out there in the market today advertise as organic. And really when you start to basically break down every single ingredient, you realize that there's only maybe one or two things that are organic in the product and everything else is just a bunch of filler, a bunch of things that are really not good for your skin because whatever you put on your face gets absorbed into your body and for me that's a big deal because I am nursing so I figured um, if I'm going to do something for myself, which is this is the only thing I've done for myself besides, really that's it, besides take a nap occasionally because I'm so busy packing and stuff so I felt like this was my me thing so um, I really do feel good about um, using these products and I haven't noticed any like flaking of my skin except for the dry patches which I've had that before so it's not like it's because of this I don't think um, it could be because the moisturizer is different but I'll touch on that in a minute so you get the charcoal detox scrub so let me or cleanser let me show you you probably won't be able to see maybe you could um, it's super dark kind of like like a dark gray color so it almost looks kind of um, like dirty muddy water and it actually smells like the first time I put this on my skin not only did it feel really great, but it felt and smelled like the soaps and cleansers they use when you go to the spa. Everything just seems so serene and just so relaxing. And every time I smell it, it just, I think of all the times that I've gone to a spa to get a facial and massages. It just smells so, I guess, comforting in a way. So I really like that. And then you also get the, let me show you the scrub. Now the scrub is something that I am just nuts about. Um, it's the jojoba charcoal uh, facial scrub which is supposed to remove dead skin impurities and toxins and it's for all skin types so even if you're not oily or acne prone you can use this. And what I like about this one is that this is different than any other scrub that I've ever used. Most scrubs that you use or you find have some sort of gritty particles whether they're crushed walnut shells or nut shells or um, particles of um, sugar that can be too, too abrasive sometimes and can kind of cause microscopic lacerations that you can't see, you know, to the naked eye, but you have like, it scratches your skin and that over time makes your skin worse. So this one, the actual beads are made of wax. So they're kind of like circular wax beads that do not feel rough. I don't feel like there are any jagged edges that really, you know, irritate my skin. I can do this twice a day, morning and night and not feel like I'm overdoing it or feel like my face is kind of um, irritated from the over scrubbing motions because I use my fingers to use this uh, product and this one is actually kind of cool because it's like really dark. Let me see if I can show you guys. So you see it's like thick, basically charcoal in a way and you, you rub it around your hands and this doesn't have a, it has a little bit of a scent to it but it's more of like a clean scent and you could just rub it around and like the little beads, if you put it on the back of your hand and rub a little bit and then you can see kind of like like these colorless beads and they're, you can tell that they're all circular, like they're round beads. They're not, you know, weird shapes. Then you get the Organic Lemon AHA and DMAE Toner, which is supposed to exfoliate and uh, firm your skin. It's supposed to um, improve your skin tone and texture and it's for normal to oily and problem skin. So basically this is a toner, which is something that I really never, um, I've purchased before toners, but I never really saw a point of it because every toner that I use made my skin burn, um, made my skin feel really dry and almost um, kind of ashy looking. And over time of using them, I noticed that it would cause my skin to have like dry patches. And that's kind of odd for oily skin because typically oily skin doesn't have dry patches. So this is the first toner that I've ever used um, that does not make my skin feel dry and it doesn't sting. It feels great. Um, and it doesn't have any alcohol in it. Um, so this is really great. This also says it's 96% organic and certified vegan. So it'll tell you on there if it's not 100% organic. Um, so obviously there's probably an ingredient or some sort of a preservative in here maybe um, to keep it from going bad and maybe that's not organic. I'm not sure, but um, this smells really good too. It has like a slight kind of lemony scent to it, which I like a lot. Then you also get a, let me show you the uh, Kaolin Clay, which is a detoxifying facial mask, 
And this is also for oily um, combo and acne prone skin. So this one is a mask that you use twice a week. Um, so what I do with this is um, if I'm going to take a shower, then I put this on and then I can hop in the shower because I take really hot showers and the steam opens up my pores and this just helps kind of get deep down and just bring everything up and get rid of a lot of the junk that I have because I have larger pores like around this area here and a couple blackheads and occasionally some cystic acne breakouts which I haven't had one in probably a while like growing like a month and a half um, so I, I can't say that it's because of this because I've only been using this for about two weeks and just keep in mind this is kind of like uh, showing you what I'm using and basically giving you like an update like my two three week mark um, this one is a, sorry mine is really dirty, I should clean it, but this one, it has a little bit of a, um, kind of like a reddish tone, and when you put it on, it looks really red. Um, it does have a little bit of a s slight stingy feel to it, um, kind of like, I wouldn't say minty because minty is, to me, is not quite as bad, but this does have a little bit of a stinging feel. After maybe about a couple minutes, I don't feel it anymore, and it just starts to dry up, just like a regular mask, and then you wipe it, wipe it off with some warm water and then you follow with the toner. And then the last piece in the kit that you get is the Moisture Light Non-Oily Hydrating Lotion. And this controls oil and shine and won't clog your pores for normal to oily and combo skin. Now, I really love this moisturizer. Um, I do feel like it's a little bit more moisturizing than what I would have thought for oily skin just because moisturizers that are for oily skin typically are very, very thin. Um, and don't really add a lot of hydration, but this one really hydrates my skin. Um, if my skin feels really great, it feels comfortable, and this, oh my god, the smell is amazing, you guys. It smells, like when I put this on, I feel like I'm a walking basket of lemons. Like, I just, I love lemons, like lemon soaps, lemon hand sanitizer, you know, just the fresh cut lemons. I'm just nuts about that. Lemon candles, lemon sprays for the kitchen, and counter sprays and cleaners. I love it. If I can get a lemon, I get lemon. And this smells divine. Like if I could eat this, I probably would. And I don't recommend that you guys eat your moisturizer, but this smells phenomenal. Like it's the best smelling moisturizer that I have ever used and probably will ever find. Um, and again, that's the moisture light, the not oily. So that's what you get. You get all these um, pieces in your kit when you order them. So it's um, five pieces in your um, the self-discovery kit um, and it comes in this little bag and it comes like in a plastic yellow tray to hold them in with the little um, paper that tells you guys about that so so far I really like it a lot obviously because I just got my order of all full-size pieces um, and I actually use the Mother's Day special and that's one of the things I want to tell you guys about um, I'm not sponsored by the company whatsoever to um, talk about the products or anything like that this is just my own money that I spent on this and my own product recommendations for you. If you follow them on Twitter, um, they always post on there when they have specials. Like a couple weeks ago, they had their serums, I think with 30 or 35% off the serums. Um, and just recently, they had the Mother's Day special where you get uh, free shipping. Um, I think it was free. I got I ordered this on Wednesday, and I just got it today, and it's Saturday. So, you know, it's you know Mother's Day is tomorrow, so if you would have ordered it in time, you would have gotten it um, with the special um, faster shipping. There's also no tax on this website, um, which is really great. You don't pay tax on anything. Um, you always have free shipping over f orders over $45, um, but you can go online and try to find coupon codes. Some other beauty gurus may have coupon codes if they partner up with the company to offer that to their, cu or to, not their customers, but to their um, viewers. You can look that way as well. I certainly wouldn't... Um, it wouldn't be a bad idea. So I ordered full size pieces, and then part of this was a free, um, a free gift. And it, I chose. You had an option of choosing um, a voucher towards flowers from Mother's Day. Um, this website called Red Envelope, which has all kinds of gifts from him, um, his gifts, her gifts, baby gifts, house gifts, jewelry, all kinds of things, and then a free gourmet box. You know those monthly subscription services. It's a box of gourmet foods. But I saw that there was something on the website for Red Envelope that I wanted for my son. So I chose that as my free gift and it was actually a $20 voucher. Um, so all I really had to do was pay for tax and shipping for the item I chose off the website. So that was also pretty neat. I did get some samples of the um, um, some of the other products. I just lost my train of thought. One of them is the toner, which I is the same lemon toner, the organic lemon toner, and also the jojoba scrub which I have already. The only thing in here is the um, pearl and silk 
facial mask, which I haven't tried. And that's for normal to dry skin or sensitive mature skin. So my skin can be sensitive sometimes, but I'll try it. Why not? What the heck? It's free, right? So the only thing I wish this website would have is the option to try other products. Like there's some serums that I want to try. So it would be great if they could offer, you know, little trial sizes, like one ounce containers of their serums for, you know, for whatever they want to ask for it. Um, obviously, if it's, you know, within the right price, I guess, for me, um, so that I can try other things. Because if I wanted to try, like, their carrot serum that's listed under the um, Acne Oily Skin page, um, I have to pay for the full price um, for the full size item. And if I don't like it, they also um, have a really good... Um, return policy you can just send any unused product and they will send you a refund a check I don't know I'm sure they they deal with that I don't know how they deal with that um, but this website is categorized by skin types so you can do um, mature skin dry skin normal skin oily acne um, and you can definitely find your skin type along um, the options that they have so I got my so today I ordered everything basically everything in the kit that I showed you and I just wanted to show you guys the um, full size product so you get an idea. Um, this is the um, charcoal scrub and this is the 7.1 ounce. Um, actually it's kind of like it's got some stuff on the outside. Some This one says 70% organic on here and then this one doesn't say anything like that on there. So this one is only 70% organic. And it's also, um, if you are wondering, it's also made in the USA. Um, I don't know, for some of you that may be important. For others, you probably don't care. But um, So this is a full size. It's a 7.1 ounce. And I want to say this was 28 or 29. I'm not sure. I, don't I just have the packing slip. I don't have my thing that I my receipts it's on my email but um, I'm gonna put the link to their website below so that you can go check it out if you're interested also if you are a big Twitter follower you know also follow me please <laughs> I will put the um, the name of the company below as well um, so like I said I'm not sponsored by any way uh, shape or form by this company um, this is just my own opinion based on what other people said I decided to jump on the bandwagon and order some of these things. So the jojoba scrub is a 3.4 ounce um, and everything was pretty, everything was between 18 and 28 or $29. So there wasn't anything over 30 bucks in my regimen of uh, products. <clears throat> well, excuse me. <clears throat> then um, the moisture light is 2.4 ounces for the full size and this was probably maybe, I don't even know, I'm confusing all the prices but I know that it wasn't that much. And then the lemon toner is 7.8 ounces. So these are going to last me a really long time. And also one of the things I noticed um, on the website, the packaging is obviously going to be different from the travel size. But the packaging, the way it's made, it's supposed to help prolong the life, shelf life of the product so that, um, you know, just the air and sun don't damage a product, which that typically happens with pretty much almost everything that has direct sunlight, makes the products go bad, especially when you're spending money on this. Um, so the packaging is really pretty basic but functional at the same time. So I really like this. I like how this has a pump and I don't have to pour it out like I do with the other one because I've kind of wasted a little bit of it. Um, but that is pretty much it. I'm going to definitely do a updated video to this um, probably in a couple weeks. Probably not till maybe the end of June um, or closer to that time frame um, so that you guys can know if this is still working for me or not. Um, by then I should have probably put a pretty good dent into these uh, full size products because I'm pretty much almost out of um, my little minis which I'm saving those actually for when I'm traveling because um, I will be um, moving in a few weeks so that's another big thing so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and um, if you have any other questions if I didn't address anything that you guys are curious about the company uh, feel free to leave me the info below um, I just kind of studied and did my homework and read on the website before doing this video. Um, so um, I can tell you from my personal experiences and answer any questions that you have. Um, so yeah, I would if you want to try some of these products, what I would do is go online and find a coupon code. Um, there is always something going on as far as sale-wise on the website. If you follow my Twitter, like I said earlier in the video, that's where I find out where most of the sales are because I don't check the website 
on a regular basis to see what's on sale just to order something. If, you know, a mask is on sale that I want to try and I see it on Twitter, I'll order it. Um, so again, you save money on the tax and free shipping if you order $45 or more. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And like I said, leave your comments or questions below and I will answer them as best as I can. And be on the lookout for future videos and an updated video of this one. And also, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. I would love to have you as a subscriber. And it's also free, so you don't have to th worry about um, paying anything or anything like that. Um, it's free. And my videos will go straight to your little inbox. And my link to Twitter will be below. And my blog, which I have been keeping up. So I'm so proud of myself because I'm keeping up with it. So um, check that out as well. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.